Greetings, everybody. Also, fire. Greetings, everybody. My name is Captain Jonasik, and welcome back to another Challenge Rift. Challenge Rift Tour 99 for Europe, and we got an LOD Lashing Tail Kick version with the Rivera Dancers. And we got the Dub Diggers. We got the Giana Kashu Lashing Tail Kick release with a piercing fireball that deals. 1400% weapon damage as fire to enemies within 10 yards on impact. Odin Sun chain, chain lightning, lightning damage. So basically, what you do is like you use your uh, lashing tail kick to do your most amount of damage. And if you're out of spirit, you can use your uh, way of the hundred feet to regain some spirit, so you can keep on slashing. It's not an easy one. Um, we're gonna have some problems. Let's get into the rift. All right, guys, so let's get this shot. So we are having here a festering woods and on the left side, you find instantly two blue packs. Make sure that your uh, slashing tail kick keeps up and then your epiphany needs to be casted Make sure that your uh, mantra is casted and your serenity every now and then for your survivability. Uh, make sure that your sweeping stack wins are up as well because you're going to do some amount of damage with it. Now we keep walking forward and we find here an next blue pack. Uh, be careful, these ones are illusionists, so you actually want to make sure that you actually kill them very fast and very easy. Uh, once again, make sure that your uh, tail kicks are coming through here you just go down instantly like on the top left on the top there's nothing there so you just go down and then you just fight some berserkers and then walk forward i clicked here on the uh channel pylon first for the reason that you will not lose your spirit when you click on that channel pylon basically all you have to do here is like just spam that tail kick to do the most amount of damage all you have to do is like make work be careful of those chairs they uh, move around a lot they actually don't die that easily you have no pickup radius that, uh, apparently this person didn't unlock the uh, automatic auto pickup orbs yet now we're just going forward and you can see that you have like six elites and a pile on this map. Alright. On the next map, Shra Moors. Alright. So we start up with a a blue here. Again, try to make quick work of them. Also, if you lose your spirit, make sure that you use your uh, way of the hundred fists. That way you regenerate a little bit of your uh, spirit and then you can keep kicking away go down here again uh, don't go over the top there's like no elite there or at least nothing that is noticeable good these blue goes in every single direction so try to make quick work of them All right. and we're just going forward to the next one you try not to go elite hunting, but you actually want to go elite hunting because you're gonna have some uh, time problems on this one. It's not an easy one. Like you have almost no survivability, and it's a very difficult one. All right, next map, West March. <laughs> try to kill as many mobs as you can along the way towards your first elite pack here. Like the person who made this build actually had a, no idea what, what this person was thinking, but I hope he's proud because damn, this was a, this, this is a tough one. So how's everybody's season 28 going? Like we're two weeks in now, how's your season going? I'm almost paragon 1700 at the moment. So my season is going pretty, Pretty okay. Here I go first to the uh, to the speed pylon for that additional attack speed. Uh, it 
it's actually not needed to go there first, but it helps you. Certainly it helps. And make sure that you do not stand in one of those grotesque explosions because they are very difficult. Also, who's ready for next weekend? Diablo 4 early access starts. I will be uh, playing that one as well and try to make some videos out of it. And, uh, show you guys some uh, Diablo 4 gameplay. All right, back to this rift. So we clicked on the power pylon the yellow there that we uh, came across right before the exit here we will find our final yellow for this uh for this challenge rip and after this we just gonna spawn the boss as we spawn Escaniel. Escaniel is a little bit of pain in the ass because he spawns his uh, arcane beams but as you can see like if I run out of spirit, I just use my uh, Wave of the Hunter Fits here and just keep trashing away. And all you have to say to Escaniel is, see you next week, dude. So guys, you just saw me clear the challenge rift. If you follow the path that I took, you will definitely clear it. Um, be wary of your tail slashing kick and I'll see you all in the next one have a good one, stay healthy and catch you all later bye bye